Hi, my Libras. It's Jamie Zebra 23. I am doing your October 2017 monthly spread. How your ex sees you, uh, feels about you, um, what your ex's intentions are. If he's going to reach out, she's going to reach out. Um, what could what could have possibly been the blockage between you two? Um, this is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and the Cross Watchers. So we've got the Knight of Pentacles. We've got the Wheel of Fortune. We've got the Queen of Swords, we've got the Four of Pentacles, and then we've got the Knight of Wands. Um, I'm on all social media. It's JamieZebra23. If you'd like a personal reading, you can check out the website. It's JamieZebra23.com. My readings are $25, $50, and $75. I typically do your readings within 24 to 72 hours. I also have a new feature, Same Day Readings. It's a little pricier, but you do get your readings the same day. I also have a $5 one question, one answer via email only. I have kits for love, money, and protection that I can ship out to you. You choose one, love, money, or protection. Um, I ship out on Mondays. You, re you uh, receive on Wednesday. I also have a um, spells for mon love, money, protection. Um, I also have... Um, smudge stick sage and i have um charcoal briquettes that you can it's instant light charcoal it comes in a pack of uh, i believe 10 miniature charcoal briquettes and then it's um it's instant light so you can burn your sage burn your rosemary whatever whatever you're trying to burn okay so this is what we got going on my libra sun moon rising venus and cross watchers you got the knight of pentacles wheel of fortune the queen of swords the four of pentacles and then the knight of wands so with these cards here this is what's up you do have a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo from the past that wants to reach out to you. I'm using the, um, whoa, whoa, oh, Nelly. I'm using the Crystal Tarot deck. Um, I love this deck. So, um, yeah. So, there is, there is a, um, the Knight of Pentacles is reaching out to you guys. It looks like, um, this person may have some money. They may have either stolen some money, come into some money, some, some way, somehow they got some money. Also, the Ten of, the Tens... It's a wheel, but it's um, the wheel of fortune, but it's a ten. So that means that they want they want to start over with you. Um, something something didn't get to get off the ground. Something stopped before it could really start into something like substantial. They want to revisit that. Also, with the Queen of Swords, um, there could be an air sign, or this woman could have the energy of an air sign. This could be you, or another air sign. Um, this could be a man or a woman air sign. I feel like this person is very much all about themselves, but the thing is this person's always alone because they can't seem to get along with others because they, or others seem to seem to not be able to get along with them. There's some, some, somehow there's always clashing energy here. Um, and also somebody sees this, uh, this queen of uh, swords, which could be a king. This could be you or another air sign. Somebody sees them as money. This could be the woman's energy. This is typically somebody who's a widow or somebody who, um, who's been hurt a lot in the past or somebody who's like, I'm never going to get hurt again. So I'm going to, I'm going to hurt you before, uh, before you hurt me. So somebody from the past like that could be trying to get back together with you because both the Knight of Pentacles and the Queen of Swords is facing the past. Um, somebody hasn't healed either you or the other party has not healed. So like, even though they want to start over, they, you can't start over with this person because they don't, they, that's the block. Emotionally, they can't. They're holding on to things. And then with the four of pentacles, um, I feel like for some of you, your, your finances weren't where you wanted them to be when you were with this person. And that is, could be a big reason. Also, um, you weren't, you weren't where you are now mentally, emotionally, your strength wasn't there, but now it's there. Also, some of you have, um, have been battling serious self-esteem issues. Some of you have been trying to get your businesses off the ground, and then maybe while this person was with you, you were trying to get your finances in check, get your children in check. You know, you're, you were trying to get all your ducks in row, but this person either couldn't hold on or they didn't take you serious because you didn't have your stuff together. And then with the Knight of Wands, so there is a Knight of Wands. Um, this could be a man or a woman, a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries, or their energy that does want to come back in, but it'll be brief. It shows that they jump in and then they jump out. So if you do decide to take back a Sagittarius, a Leo, or an Aries, strong Sagittarius energy, um, then expect it not to, maybe four days tops, four days, four weeks tops, and then they'll be back out again. So if that's what you want to deal with, go for it. But if not, also expect to get some phone calls from a Capricorn, a Taurus, or a Virgo. Um, some of you are have your back turned to this Capricorn, Taurus, or a Virgo, so some of you are not going to even bite when this person calls you. 
also um the reason why capricorn a taurus or a virgo might be getting in touch with you is because of a um because a sagittarius a leo or an aries kicked them out or doesn't want anything to do with them or they're trying to piss off a sagittarius a leo or an aries all right guys ta-ta for now